Andy, uh, you'd think after spending an entire year filming myself that I'd know what I'm doing, but I don't. But, um, my name is Katie Berlin, and this is a letter to my sister. Dear Mandy. Okay, so, what am I gonna do today? I guess we can reflect. This is, okay, th so this is gonna be, this is gonna be the Letters to My Sister Holiday Special. That doesn't have the star in it, but you, you know, that's besides the fact. I already have two pretty good Christmas gifts for you, but I figured I'd do this for you as well. I'd make you a video, because you've spent a lot of time making me videos and I still technically haven't responded. I guess I was in a few of your videos, but technically that wasn't like a letter back. So this is my letter back to you. It only took me a year and a half, but you know, better late than never. So I guess we can reflect on the year that was 2020. Let's focus on the happy things. Well, okay. Let's talk about what happened and then we'll try to focus on the positives. What were we doing this time last year? Well, we had already done the holiday con the holiday extravaganza. I did Carols and Coco. We did Horns of Caroling. And then what did we do in January? Well, I went back to school and you went back to school. Oh, in February, you went to district band and you, uh, you chaired first. That was pretty cool. And then the world shut down. And then I came home and we hung out at home and tried not to kill each other. I don't think we came close to killing each other. And we thought that was gonna last till like May. And then we thought it was gonna last till like the end of June. And then we thought it was gonna last like through the summer. And now we just kind of think it might end have a vaccine kind of so that's pretty cool let's hope but what did we do during quarantine well we made videos i started baking i baked like every day i baked cookies mostly so that happened we watched tiger king and i know i know it's been like months since tiger king was a thing but like i never got to talk about it so i'm gonna do the next segment which is katie talks about tiger king even though it's like a year old so there are things that in that documentary that I think are important that nobody talks about. And it's occurring to me now that Mandy never finished Tiger King, so why am I talking about it? But that doesn't matter because I'm gonna talk about it for just a little bit. Like, he was married to two men and both of them insist that they were not gay, but he was married to them. And also he wasn't that attractive to begin with. And like, does he have a lot of money? Because it didn't seem like he had a lot of money. Also, Carol Baskin's husband is definitely under her septic tank. I don't believe for a second that he isn't. Um, and also that one guy was like running a tiger brothel and nobody talks about that part. And to me, that was like the most important part because again, he was not that attractive. So what is it about the tigers? What, what is it? Do women dig tigers? Cause I'm not that into tigers. Is that a thing? Comment below. Are you into tigers? If you're a woman, comment below. Are you into tigers? Anyway, this has been Katie Talks About, a year old documentary that nobody is talking about. Well, the summer came and we taught at the art house and I'm going to use this opportunity to tell one of my favorite stories about Mandy at the art house. Hi kids, so do you guys want to play a game today? Yeah, let's play Truth or Dare. Truth or Dare is stupid. Nobody likes Truth or Dare. Let's play Would You Rather. Would you rather eat a pine cone or yourself? You can't eat yourself because that's illegal. And you can't eat a pine cone because pine cones have glue in them. Pine cones do not have glue in them. They do. Pine cones have glue in them. You can't eat them. What are you talking about? Pine cones do not have glue in them. All right, everybody. Who wants to play a song on the ukulele? So that happened. And then I went back to school and I did band and you did band and you were awesome. And I was so proud of you because you were the drum major, just like me and you, you spun the mace and you were like Katie 2.0 and I was so proud. And then I guess that kind of brings us to the present because we haven't been doing that. I mean, you've been making a lot of videos and we've both been doing a lot of schoolwork. And I have filmed myself more in the past year than I ever wanted to. 
there are so many videos of my phone of me singing or playing or not or doing them incorrectly so I guess I just wanted to take this opportunity to say that I love you so, so much. And I'm so glad to be home with you during this time of year. And if any of our friends are watching, I'm sorry that we can't be together with you this Christmas, but know that we're here in your hearts and we're thinking about you. Um, I love you all so dearly. And maybe next Christmas we'll be able to celebrate all together. So I guess that's it. Um, I'm going to go try to edit this without you realizing I'm editing it, and then I'm going to try to sneak on your computer and post this to your YouTube channel without you knowing. So I'll let you know how that goes, or I guess you'll see how that goes, but um, I love you so much. Bye!